Cardiff's exciting new dining out experience on Castle Street is set to officially open, but how will it all actually work? I'll take you through it. Firstly, there's no advanced booking, so wherever you can grab a seat, go for it. The max seating is a table of six, and there are two dining areas, both of which are exactly the same, so pick either one you want. Now, as is expected to be quite busy, you may need to queue until a host finds you a seat. The facilities are also wheelchair and pushchair friendly, with high chairs available as well. Of course, the cafe has been designed with social distancing as an utmost priority. Hand sanitizer is provided as well, and customers are kindly asked to take any of their own waste to a recycling point afterwards. Now, all that drinking and eating may leave you needing the toilet. No worries, there's one located in the Clock Tower car park and includes disabled toilets as well as baby changing facilities. Now, when it comes to actually ordering the food, you will see these QR codes on your table. Just open your smartphone and scan the code or you can type cardiffcastle.yoello.com into your web browser as well. The Castle Quarter Cafe will also be participating in track and trace, so you will need to fill out a short form before you make your first order. Now for the good stuff, the food of course. You can peruse the selection of menus on offer. Here you can choose your grub and pay at the end, quite simple. You'll also be able to see wait times to see how long you'll be waiting for your food and drink too. And that's it, just sit back and wait for your food to arrive. All the boxes and cutlery and all that kind of stuff will be compostable and there is no minimum spend. Unless you want alcohol, you will need to spend at least £10 on food before you can get that. Then once you have finished or your two hour limit is up, simply gather your rubbish and take it to the recycling bins on your way out. Easy. Right, I'd love to keep chatting, but I've got a table to find. I'll see you in a bit.